Senex Technology and the First Look Sensor present Louis Nelson from Advanced Training Systems. Using the Bosch OTC Touch and the 3857 scope, Louis will demonstrate how to quickly determine the mechanical integrity of an engine using the First Look Sensor by Senex Technology. In this demonstration, we're going to connect our Bosch OTC Touch with our PC-based 3857 scope to the vehicle and we're going to diagnose our mechanical issue. Our vehicle today happens to be a 2008 Chevrolet Impala. This particular vehicle has a 3500 V6 engine. We're going to connect to the induction side, the intake system of this vehicle with our first look sensor here and then connect the other end to our lab scopes. In this next demonstration, Louis will show you how to make a vacuum connection as well as an exhaust connection with the first look sensor. We must first find ourselves a centrally located vacuum source that covers the whole induction system. We're going to take our largest one on this particular application, this is a 2008 uh, Chevrolet Impala with a 3500 engine, going to the brake booster, pulling it off the brake booster, and then being able to take our adapter, making sure we have a nice snug fit. This now couples it up so that our sensor samples the vacuum within this induction system. With our first look connected to our BNC coupling here, we're going to take and compress these springs backward. This is going to allow us to stick it into the tailpipe. And so it'll stay. You just gently insert it. Now, depending on the exhaust system and its quality, you may require to put rags, wet preferably, into it. Then it allows the pressure in the system to be more sensed. Next, Louis demonstrates a bad cranking waveform test on the problem vehicle using the Bosch scope to confirm the ODB code. In this case, a PO300 random multiple cylinder misfire detected code as an accurate representation of what is wrong with this vehicle. But, as you will see by the waveform produced, we have a loss of pressure that repeats itself. This indicates we have a mechanical problem with the engine and not a misfire, as the PO300 code suggested. Let's connect up our Bosch 3857 scope. Go ahead and crank. As you can see from this waveform taken very quickly, we can see that we have a loss of pressure at this point in time repeating itself over here. So even though we're on a six-cylinder engine, this is constantly repeating itself. This is timed to a single cylinder. That means mechanical problem. This is definitely a bad waveform. In this next demonstration, Louis will perform a cranking waveform test to show you what a repaired vehicle's good waveform should look like using the Bosch scope. With our Bosch scope connected to our tailpipe, we're going to be able to take and pull a sample here. Go ahead and crank. As you can see, with our sample complete, we now have a repaired vehicle and all our cylinders' pressures are equal. Now that we've diagnosed our PO300, our misfire has turned into a mechanical problem, which was perfect for our first look sensor. And with this equipment here, we were able to diagnose it accurately the first time. Thank you again for participating. If you have questions for Mr. Nelson, he can be reached by using the information shown here. If you have questions regarding the Bosch 3857 scope, please contact Bosch by using the information on your screen. For more information about Senex technology and the First Look sensor, including how to obtain sensor kits and manuals for performing diagnostics on either spark plug or diesel engines, please visit our website.